Hey, so like uh, some time ago on some planet called Evergreen, which, hey, it's not really green, there were these really weird guys that would just kill anything that was in their path, and there was a bunch of dudes that would just attack villages and basically mess around with them. And then there was some guy who called himself the Lich King and kind of plagued the world with undead legion in darkness or whatever. Kind of not cool, to be honest. And the only place that really seemed safe was something we called Sky Haven back in the day. There was a floating island overwatching it was this orb of light. Dude, that orb of light was rad. Like, you should have seen the sight. <laughs> but no one really knew what was up there, and also no one could really go there. So all hope kind of seemed lost. Until some guys rode out of the shadow that called themselves the Heroes of the Land. Wow, and their objective was to free the land from its impending doom. And they won a bunch of battles, fought a bunch of dudes, people joined them. After they did everything, everything was at peace. So that's cool. I like peace. They told stories and tales of their heroic deeds, spreading their influence across the lands, and everything was finally at peace. I don't know why I just said that twice, but you know what? Screw you. But one day, the Sky Haven Orb of Light left the atmosphere. Like, whoa, where did you go? And soon, the island just dropped to the ground like a body or whatever. None of the dust, some guy, I don't, I don't really know, some, some, some thing. It was like the Scorcher. Yeah, yeah, he's a real bad dude. It kind of like brought a bunch of destruction. It just kind of destroyed everything in a blink of an eye and basically knocked down everything we built. Many of us were basically idiots to go against him. I mean, come on. Why would you guys go against him? He's powerful. He's going to kill everyone. And so most, most, I mean, most of us fled. We're not cowards. We're just smart. That's why I'm here telling you the story. And those who were idiots kind of fought him, met with a terrible fate, blah, blah, blah. They all died. And afterwards, he claimed himself the god of Evergreen, which is a lame name, to be honest. And this was basically uh, Evergreen's way of saying, it's kind of a darkest hour, we're in a sucky place, Great Depression, blah, blah, blah. But, 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 hold on, hold on. This is where this new story begins. It was like, totally radical, dude. T totally should do it.